either. Now we've got something on the other side that I was telling folks about last yep. night that we want to talk about, and that is the Swanee Riverkeeper Songwriting Contest. Tell us about that. That's right. And we've been doing this several years, not quite as many as the other one, I believe. This is our fourth year on this one. And uh, what um, yeah, we deal with the entire Suwannee River Basin, that's 10,000 square miles from Cornell to the Gulf and from the swamp, Okefenokee Swamp to the Gulf. And uh, how many songs do you know about the Withacoochee River? Right. There you go. The Alapaha River. Well, actually, we, we have some now because of the songwriting contest. How about the Suwannee River? Now, nah, nah, everybody knows the way down up uh -huh. on the Suwannee River. That's right. Everybody knows that one. And there's a couple that's got Suwannee in it that you might know. But there need to be more, and there are now. Uh, Save Our Suwannee won uh, two times back. That's by a fellow from Jacksonville. And um, we got... Uh, 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 one of our local uh, bands, uh, uh, Dirty Bird and the Flu, came with something called a Lapaha Lap Hogs. Oh, hmm, okay. Mm -hmm. It was a funk number. It perturbed some of our committee. Like, what? It says, it's fun. Oh, okay. <laughs> hmm. Well, I'll tell you what. If you'd give me just a minute, we got to go pay a bill. And when we come mm -hmm. back, we're going to talk a little bit about how you can how folks can get involved in this in the Swanee Riverkeeper Songwriting Contest. We'll be All right. right. We'll be right back.